What is going on guys? Welcome to Greggles TV Daily, your source for daily tech news. Make sure you subscribe so you know what's going on in the world of tech. How is everyone doing? Let's get into the news. Being Sunday, Sundays are usually slow tech news days, but we have one really big, interesting story, and it's about Samsung. And Samsung has filed a patent with America, the United States Patent Office, about a fingerprint sensor that would go underneath the display. Now, before I jump into the screenshots and all that, of course, this isn't really a new rumor, but this filing of this patent is brand new and it gives even more detail to exactly how Samsung will be using the in-display fingerprint. Now, based off some of these screenshots here, it looks like you'll be able to unlock the phone anywhere on the screen. So it won't be just at the bottom, like some other in-display fingerprints that are out right now, but it will be anywhere on the display. And I guess that also affects uh, specifically battery life when you uh, are able to do something like this rather than setting it as a, in a specific area. It also uh, affects the accuracy of it, but overall, the major thing I think you can take from this is that you can place it anywhere to unlock uh, the phone. Some other screenshots show that you can unlock it with up to four fingerprints at once. So I don't know if that would be some kind of um, special thing that if you wanted to get into the phone or the or, or the device, that you'd have to use four fingerprints in order to be able to do that. Um, I don't see, obviously, I don't know. It's just, I can see use cases maybe in a corporate environment, maybe not so much in a uh, you know person's day-to-day -day life to want to be able to do that. It also looks like you'll be able to set specific areas to unlock the phone with the in-display fingerprint sensor. So if you don't wanna to have to put it all over the screen, you can place it at the bottom or you know somewhere else on the phone. That would be always be the designated area. And also reading it from the article, it seems like that would help with battery life and accuracy. You'll also be able to use this like you can now to make mobile payments. So if you have like Samsung Pay or Android Pay, you'd be able to use that in-display fingerprint to get uh, your payments to work on your phone. So I definitely recommend checking out the article. It is very interesting and it is quite long, it has tons of screenshots on this patent for Samsung. It doesn't say obviously which specific phone it's going to be in. I can only assume it's going to be in either the 2019 phones or the 2020 phones. There's already rumors that the 2019 Galaxy devices will have the in-display fingerprint sensor. I don't know if that those ones are gonna have it designated to just the bottom half of the phone or if it's gonna be the whole entire display. But this is amazing, cool technology that I am dying to try to see how cool it is and works. And it's just an interesting technology overall. And it's one of the newer technologies uh, that we've seen in a phone that phones generally don't have or all have yet. Guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to new videos every single day. My question out to you guys is, what do you think about that patent? Is it something that gets you excited about the next device that Samsung or some other manufacturer puts out? Let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching. See you down the road. Peace.